Hey guys, what's up? It's the Epic Cubish here, and welcome to another video. In this video, I have an unboxing from the cubicle.us. Okay, so in this box, I had the Yushin 5x5, some replacement stickers, and of course the cubicle business card. So this is just my favorite color scheme because I know that the Yushin stickers aren't particularly my favorite, and I just decided to get those to stick on it because I'm expecting this to be my main. This cube has a lot to live up to for me because the Yushin 4x4 is my main, and the Yushin 3x3 is my backup main. So this has a lot to live up to, I guess you could say. The box is pretty cool. It's a little bit opened, but it can it can close. It's nice plastic, and here is the puzzle in here. Looks pretty dirty, like it's got a bunch of stuff on it, but that's not too big of a deal. Let's go ahead and take it out. Wow. The cube itself is really light. Wants to move around a bit. Actually has more of a moyushi. Holy cow! So, yeah, I'd say that I wanted to move around a little more than just a bit. Um, <laughs> I'll be right back, guys. <laughs> okay, guys, I am back. And I know that that was only like a second for you guys, but for me, it was about two and a half weeks. What happened is there was a little center cap that decided that it wanted to break. So this is supposed to be a little more solid than it is right now, and it actually broke, which caused the whole face to completely fall off. And after several emails of going back and forth with the cubicle, they told me that they could not send me a new puzzle. So instead, they sent me a replacement part, and I reassembled it myself. So this is the same puzzle, but it just has a re reassembled replacement cap. And I've had it reassembled for about, not even 24 hours yet, and I have done a couple of solves on it. I played around with it a little bit. So this has gone from an unboxing to more of a first impressions video. So let's go ahead and get started with a puzzle. First thing I noticed when I took it out was that the shades of it are basically Moyu. They don't look anything like the Yushin products that I had seen in the past, which I thought was very interesting. I'm just gonna go ahead and move this out of the way. So basically they just kind of changed the whole look of it. Let's go ahead and have a look at the shades. There it is. I mean, you can see it's it's Moyu. And if you didn't know what Moyu shades look like, they look like this. So it looks a lot like a Moyu. And the actual feel of the puzzle and the turning is very, very fast. And the closest puzzle that I can actually describe the way that it feels to me is actually the Waylong V1, which is a Moyu puzzle. So I'm kind of getting the impression that this is basically a Moyu, v1, Moyu Waylong V1 that has just been kind of grown to a five by five. But on the bright side, Moyu Waylong is a great puzzle. The turning is super fast. I was very, very impressed. It does kind of feel like it's gonna explode at any second, but I think after I do some tensioning to it and kind of set it up, it'll get really, really nice. So yes, the turning is very, very good. Corner cutting is a full piece on the first layer, second layer. Looks like it's going to kind of catch a little bit, about a half a piece, and then that's all you really need. You're not going to do any more than that because you don't turn from the center. Reverse corner cutting is... Very slim reverse corner cutting, almost none. But I mean, you don't need too much of it because you're on a five by five. And I found that this thing moves very, very well and definitely will be my main because all I have currently is an unmodded Shang Xiao five by five. Well, I guess that's not true anymore. Now I have the Yushin. So overall, it's a very impressive puzzle. It took a while to get, and I have to say, I'm not quite sure it'll be worth the wait so far, but I think it definitely will be. 
It's at a very, very reasonable price, and after I set it up, I'm sure it'll get that much better. I will be coming out with a proper review on this puzzle. This was just kind of a first impressions, and that will be out shortly, so be sure to stick around for that. We have just reached the end of this video. I hope that you guys did enjoy, and if you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like. And if you'd like more content, please subscribe. I'm the Epic Cuber, and you have an epic day. Bye.